Tyler here with GP Knives, and today we have the Stiedemann ZKC B02. This is a titanium frame lock folder. It's got a blade made from CTS204P that's going to have performance similar to that of Bowler N390. It's got a high level of wear resistance and corrosion resistance, and is going to be a very good performing blade steel in terms of its corrosion resistance and its cutting ability. It also takes a very fine edge and is a micro pure steel. The blade has dual thumb studs, so it can be operated left or right handed. It's got a bearing pivot, so the operation is very quick and smooth as you can see. So it's not a flipper, but it does open quickly as a flipper would. The handle scales are made from a bead blast titanium that is milled and textured on the chamfered edges. And then it's got thick blue anodized titanium liners and matching anodized backspacer and anodized pocket clip. And this bead blast gray and blue is the GP Knives exclusive colorway. And here's another quick size comparison. So you can see that we got the Kershaw skyline on the right. These two are nearly identical in length in the handle. You can see that the skyline is going to be a little bit thinner thanks to that single liner construction. Uh, what is interesting here is that the Stiedemann and the Skyline, while being similar in handle length, the Kershaw Skyline actually has a shorter blade length. So here you can see the general size of the knife overall. And we'll also compare it to the Spyderco Paramilitary 2, another EDC favorite. So you can see that the B02 is significantly smaller in terms of its length in the handle. You're going to add a fairly similar thickness in the handle. And then, of course, importantly, we've got the blade. So you can see that the blades are similar in length. But what you're going to notice is that the cutting edge on the B02 is significantly longer. So for that blade length, you're getting more cutting edge. You can also see here that while the thickness in general is not as great on the BO2, it does have a stronger and more robust point. It's got a pretty high height saber grind with a long, almost full length swedge on the top. So you still have a very fine point and a high level of slicing capability. And then here we've got the handles again, so you can see the difference in that handle length. But overall, these knives are fairly similar in size and they're both going to be excellent EDC options. The B02 has a slimline design that makes for easy carry and deployment of the knife and allows for easy access to other items in the pocket while carrying. The blade deploys smoothly on the bearing pivot and is readily available for use. If you like what you've seen today and you'd like to see more, check out the rest of our YouTube channel, like the video below, and subscribe to our feed for updates on all new and upcoming videos. Again, that's the Stiedemann Zahn Knife Company B02. Check it out now at gpknives.com. Thanks for watching, and stay sharp.